Oh, that's the first I've seen that. Yeah. Is that our new Halloween animation? It sure is. Because guess spooky. what? We're just a few weeks away. Not even. Two weeks away, I think. Right. I'm surprised we haven't talked more about Halloween. Oh, don't worry. Is it because of the election? It's ramped up oh, now. It's ramping up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Corey's out trick-or-treating right now. This may be our first Halloween story. Oh. Oh, no, you know? missed them all last oh, did week. I? Oh, oh, okay. We were at every costume oh, shop oh, last sorry. week. <laughs> I was on vacation. <laughs> so was Corey. It's okay. Oh, you missed him too, I missed then. all the fun while I was on vacation. But, Dad, we're going to re-ramp things up now. We're at the uh, Lego Discovery Center, Arizona, here at Arizona Mills Mall. We brought some friends out. This is their Brick or Treat program. Now, we've got everybody here. We've got Unicorn, of course. We've got Dash from uh, The Incredibles. Uh, Batman, of course. This is Miles from his own Disney show. We've got uh, Sergeant. Sergeant, Sergeant here, also Russell Wilson. Very good. Go, just run down there as fast as you can, like Russell would. Go. You're being chased by a linebacker. There you go. We'll see you in a couple hours. All right. We got uh, Peacock Princess over here. Girl Werewolf and her date. Boy Werewolf. Yeah. Now I, I know. How's it working out so far? Um. Yeah. You both look insulted by the idea. I, I like that. Look at these twins over here. Although you don't live in the same house, right? Yeah, well, you still look like you're having fun together. We got Boo and Boo 2 over here. Of course, we've got this uh, ancient, uh, beautiful princess and Alice from Alice in Wonderland. All right, you guys, go find some fun, and we'll get with you again in just a second. So, Alec, you guys, I love what Lego does. You, you're, you're forward thinkers. I'm sure you've been planning on Halloween for a while. Let's take a little uh, tour around here and give us folks an idea of what they can enjoy once they get here. Sure, yeah, we've got so much fun decoration going on. We've got... Everything looks spooky. It's spooky everywhere. Let's I mean, there's so thing. much you can do with Halloween. We've got our mini land is completely decorated. Uh, that's where all of our Arizona buildings are made out of Lego. We've got a bunch of spooky, scary monsters in there. A lot nice. of fun to see there. We have a pumpkin patch. You can learn to build a pumpkin. Uh, really? Yeah, yeah. It's a, there's a whole bunch of pumpkins set up with our graveyard. It's a lot of fun. And we'll uh, head in there in a little bit. Love it. Now, when families come, um, I, I, how, how much time does the average family spend in this place? It's so huge. I mean, is this like an all-day affair, half day? Spend a couple hours? What? Well, there is a lot of see, a lot to see, and you know, there's um, about two to three hours is what we we plan on. But uh -huh. families have spent the whole day here. Really? Yeah. I love that. Hey, you guys! Hey, follow me over here. Come on, Alec. Let's see what's what. Now, you were talking about building. Oh, there you go. Jump in. Build start. Pumpkins, let's guys. go. Let's build some pumpkins. I don't even know how that's pot. How in the world could you build a round pumpkin out of these square bricks? Oh, there's a lot of techniques, and kids seem to find them on their own. They only need a little bit of help from me. I mean, I'm always impressed by what they build. <laughs> Very impressive. Now, is this? Uh, this looks like it might be some of. Some of your work is that what we're looking That's at? One of, yeah, I made that one. That's mm -hmm. you know, I made a few example ones. Get the kids going. Very mm -hmm. good. So. Uh, Anything special going on as we roll our way toward uh, Halloween when families get here? Um, yeah, one of the most th the, one of the things I'm most excited about is our uh, minifigure trading. So on oh. weekends we have these special um, Halloween themed minifigures. We have four total, and you can bring any minifigure you have at home and trade with anybody oh, who works here. We all wear them it. on our badges. Yeah. Oh, good. Let's see. You got some tired old. Uh, who knows? Some Star Wars character. Let's say you've got who's the one? Bar uh, Jar Jar Binks. Jar Jar Binks. Nobody yeah, likes get him. Rid of him. Yeah, get bring him in. Ah, I love the idea. All right, you guys, have fun. More coming your way from uh, Arizona Lego Discovery or Discovery. Tell me the name again. I was uh, so close. Lego Land Discovery Center, Arizona. Oh. Next time. Yeah. All right. We'll We're see you guys close. again in a couple of minutes. Look at it. I felt close, but princesses. yeah. And I love you. Got Legos in there, is which is key. That is key. At Legoland, it should be. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen so many orange Legos. I know. Oh. I used to love Legos when I was a kid. Halloween time. It is. Just and, a couple of weeks away. And Lego time and Corey time at Legoland Discovery Center at Arizona Mills Mall. Corey. Hey, buddy. Now, Troy, tell me, what was your go-to out? Let's say there's a, you're about a nine-year-old Troy Hayden. Okay. What, what, are you, uh, what are you dressing up as? Um, what did I go out? I think it went Spider, mm, Spider-Man one year. Yeah. I dressed up as a girl a couple of years, <laughs> which was like, you know, pretty novel back then. My mom gave me all of her clothes. I, we have the internet. <laughs> We've all seen that stuff. <laughs> That's yeah. about, what about you? What'd you go well, as? Oh, this is good. Well, we, 
We didn't hobo. have a lot of dough. A uh, couple of years is a hobo. I know. It's, every year he tells us this story. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I miss the days when we could even say hobo. I think Are we, we not allowed to? Say to? It now, but oh, okay. Oops. Probably Sorry. not. I'm okay. sure we're injuring somebody by saying it. I'm sure. uh, but who cares? Hey, look at I'm this. The Hayden haunted flower mill. mill over there in Tempe. Isn't that? it amazing? This village that Alec Posta and his crew have put together, it is so realistic, so lifelike, and there's so much detail in it. You could spend all day looking at it, and Alec, you've haunted it up for us here at Halloween, but you say this is one of the most fun areas for the moms and dads, right? Oh, for everybody. You know, there's just so much to see in the mini land, and every time you come in, you can see some small little scene that you didn't catch the last time you were here, So, and we're always changing it, so it's a lot, a lot of fun in this room. Well, I mean, there are plenty of zombies on Mill Avenue just on a regular <laughs> Saturday night. I see you really, uh, really, really made it busier. We've turned their skin green, yeah. Uh, I love it. So as we kind of head down the row here, you're going to find all kinds of Halloween touches in addition to the usual mini village fun. I love what you've done to the downtown area here. Chase Tower, the Westward Ho. What's happening up top there? Oh, we've got our uh, mama spiders taking over the some of the tallest buildings in Phoenix with their web, and uh, looks like she's caught a few people up there. I don't think they were there last that doesn't time I was look here. Good. Yeah. No. You know, my dream would be if that huge spider could wrap its web around that tower on the top of the Westward Ho and just pull it down to the <laughs> earth and get rid of it, because I find it. I think a lot of people think, why do we still have that thing? TV came in 1948. But thank you for recreating it, even though we don't course, need the we tower. Have to be accurate. We've yes, we do. Be accurate. So um, as we move over here toward uh, Sky Harbor, uh, you have a bit of a contest coming up. Uh, what's happening as we get toward Halloween? Yeah, it's actually a um, scavenger hunt we're doing here in Miniland. So we have a bunch of. Uh, like clues that lead you to some special ghouls and monsters hidden out throughout Miniland, and they're all holding letters. They'll spell a message. Uh, you figure out what they're trying to tell you, and you enter the contest. You can win some great prizes at the end of the month. Love it. Alec Posta, thanks so much for all of your creativity. You're an artist of the highest order. We love what you've done here. So, again, come see us at the Legoland Discovery Center, Arizona, right here at Arizona Mills Mall. We'll see you guys again yes. soon. Okay. Now that's well beyond Look at that. any of the Lego stuff that I did. That's a great I Southwest know. place. I can build a fantastic square house. <laughs> square house. So or good. like a wall. Yeah, or, or like, like a you know, leaning tower of Pisa. Pretty good with that. A square version of one.